is this? Uh, where's my stuff? The gauntlet! Uh, I guess it's Jack's now. Gotta get back. Find the admin. Find my friends. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. Hey, disembodied voice, where am I? The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. Yeah, I heard you. He's just here to make sure all guests behave themselves. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, yes, Jesse. Welcome to the Sunshine Institute. It's a reformatory for people the admin has found difficult. I'll be your warden. So the admin created this nut hut too, huh? Of course. The admin is an endless source of building brilliance. Including this beautiful behavioral adjustment retreat center. I'm sure we'll get along just famously. Yeah, I don't know if I'd call this place brilliant. <sighs> it is the most brilliant. Y you know he's not here right now, right? You never know. My friends! I need to get back. The admin put his gauntlet on one of them. Who knows what he's making them do? He gave them the gauntlet? Oh, man, lucky them. That means they're the admin's favorite. <laughs> How great would that be? I bet your friend is living it up. Enjoying the high life right by the admin's side. It really doesn't last long. The admin's a finicky little tyrant. That's exactly the kind of attitude that got you sent here. And if your friends are anything like you, they'll be making their journey to Betterment right next to you, I'm sure. Now hang on a tick. I have a... another guest on my manifest. Female. Hothead. Favorite weapon? Sword. Favorite tool? Sword. Favorite food? Sword? You gotta distract him. Petra, that's definitely Petra. Jesse! Oh man, I am so happy I found you. This freaking place. I know, let's get out of here. Wait, you can't, it's too dangerous. Stop them, associates! Feeling shouty? Shouty, punchy, butt kicky, freaking admin! He tricked us! He tricked me! Oh, it just makes me want to scream! Again! Ah! Well, I know one thing. I'm glad you're here with me. You're glad, and I'm mad. It's a combo I can work with. And the admin has Jack. It never ends with that guy. Looks like we're trapped. Not gonna lie to you, Jesse. Not sure how we're gonna get out of this one. Hey, stop the alarm! We'll never make it through like this. And we run! Where? Wherever they aren't. Stop them! Don't let them reach the burrows!
where we are. What is that? Weird monsters. Are those zombies? Ah! This thing is endless. Petra, Petra. Jesse, where'd you go? Really wish I had that gauntlet right about now. Yeah, maybe not this way. Oh, what are those things? A spider? A creeper? Must be the admin creating his version of what a monster should look like. Why would there be only one? There's never just one. Oh no, oh no, oh no! Ended in an escape attempt. <sighs> that is just. That is just rude. Take this one to the mushroom. And bring that one to my office. Now. Close the door, would you? Do as you're told. Go on. Uh, sure. Obedient. Good. You and your band of misfits may have hope yet. Band of misfits? Oh, let me show you. Radar! Nerm! You see, here at the Sunshine Institute, there are two types of guests. People who make the admin extra angry, such as yourself, and your punch-happy friend down there. And there are people who the admin sends to make sure the first group will be, uh, well behaved. Your friend, with the glasses, is surprisingly feisty for such a skinny guy. You think you want to mess with me and my friends? 
you think wrong. You mess with me, and you mess with my friend. The admin. And that's something you definitely don't want. Bring up Jesse's leverage, would you? Skinny guy? Glasses? Funny story. When I first got here, I was actually part of the second group. We were just a crazy couple of griefers. And simpler times. No, 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 no! This place is filthy! Ah, ah, so disorganized! Ah, making me crazy! Jesse! Oh, I'm so glad you're okay! I was so... I was so worried! Oh, this place is terrible! Radar, stop struggling, okay? We need to be obedient and listen to the nice warden here. Wait, what? Jesse, I'm confused. Meet the Iron Breath Taker. Iron bars to hold the victim in place below. Sticky piston above to shove an iron block down over their head. <gasps> be obedient. Be obedient. <laughs> Now, I said before that you could follow in my footsteps. That could start now. Ready to improve that pesky bad behavior of yours and join the good guys? Work for me as an associate and help bring order to these poor, chaotic individuals. Don't do it, Jesse! <laughs> What's it gonna be? No freaking way, Warden. Go eat a slime ball. Ah, oh, some people. Don't say I never tried to help. Oh, whoa. Long time in there. Feeling a little dizzy. Oh my gosh, Radar, are you okay? Oh, your eye! Jesse, is that you? Don't worry, I got you, buddy. <laughs> Knew you wouldn't give in. <laughs> Not getting away with this, buddy. They'll pay, but it's gonna be a hefty price. Heck yeah! Heck yeah! Well, well, well. Jesse, Jesse, Jesse. Stella? What are... how... Well, I appreciate you letting me out of that ice. I can't let that disrupt the new professional relationship we have now, okay? I'm sure you understand. I knew a day of reckoning would come for my rival. Oh. You two know each other? <laughs> oh, yes. Our bitter rivalry goes way back. Yeah, this place really suits you, Stella. It's cruel, uncomfortable, and nobody likes it. Oh, you're letting your jealousy get the better of you, Jesse. Pity. Watch out for this one, Warden. Jesse plus anything equals trouble. Now come on, Jesse. No one wants a sour rival. Be like me. I'm a shining example of success. I barely arrived and I'm already bossing you around. <laughs> Isn't it grand? Let's go, Randall. It's Radar! Uh, that's what I said. <sighs> Stella's right. Commitment and loyalty to the admin's cause are cornerstones around here. The more friends stick together, the harder they make it for each other. So maybe... Readjust your concerns. There are bigger silver fish to fry than... than... friends. What kind of message is that? You're worse than the admin. What? You don't really think that, do you? What are you hiding, Warden? Not every prisoner here wears orange, Jesse. Let's go, rival! That's right! Go along, Jesse, to the mushroom! Exactly what I was going to suggest. I'll have your job before you know it, Warden. Be careful what you wish for, Stella.
rivals. Show them around, would ya? Thanks. Excuse me? <laughs> Who are you supposed to be? We don't have a problem, do we? I need a moment to process. Maybe several moments. You have to watch your back with her. She's ruthless. Ta-ta, Jesse. I'll be at my post supervising a more impressive cell block. Don't be too jealous. Or do. I wouldn't blame you. You okay, Radar? Wish I was. I need something to eat. Get my strength back. <laughs> You're in the right place. Guests make mushrooms too here. Guess I just need some mushrooms then. There's one! MUSHROOM! I'm gonna starve. Waste away. Oof. No more radar. You don't have anything in your inventory? You're usually so well prepared. Usually. Only I showed up here with no food, no goods, no nothing. Like everybody else. I saw Petra earlier. She might know what to do. Hey, how's it going? Noticed you got a cookie there. Cookie? Uh, what, what cookie? That was just a wood slab. Crazy me crazy thinking they saw cookies over here. Go grab a mushroom. Hey, are you busting out of here? <laughs> Everyone gives up on account of the mining fatigue, but they just don't got the patience. It just takes longer, see? Just a little bit at a time. Mm -hmm. What is that guy up to? Oh, hi friend. You just caught me putting the happy little finishing touches on my happy little painting here. What, uh, what you painting? I'd so love to paint a happy little mushroom, but none ever stick around long enough for me to paint. Do you think you could be so kind as to build me a happy little mushroom to paint? Here's some wonderful dirt for you to use. Thank you. 
Now that is just, that is just lovely. Thank you ever, ever so much. Please, you must share your thoughts on my work so far. Don't you hold back now. Honesty's the best policy. Three words. Worst painting ever. Well, that just fills me with an angry big rage. Look, I have something important to ask. Go ahead. Any idea how to get some food around here? Your best bet's the mushroom pit. That's where all the guests get their food. This is what people look like where I come from. Noted. Sorry. How'd you get that bowl of stew there? I don't know what you heard, but you won't get any free food from me, fresh meat. Get out of here! So, what got you tossed in here? None of your business. Was it embarrassing? None of your business. What if I go first? There was this gauntlet. Stop it. Got any idea how to bust out of here? Hey, you're one of us. I can tell you. Really? No. Alright then, this was... enlightening. Not really. <laughs> As Jesse walked up to Brick, Jesse noticed that he was narrating all of Jesse's actions. How do you know my name? Jesse was surprised to learn that the reputation of the Wither Slayer, the leader of the Order of the Stone, had spread so far. Brick was curious what Jesse thought of someone who narrated every action around himself. Brick waited for Jesse to say something. What would it be? He wondered. Jesse approved of Brick and his quirks. Jesse winked with approval, like this. Brick was happy for the approval, but didn't appreciate Jesse stealing his thing. I mean, come on, it was his thing first. I need to get some food, any tips? Brick looked out on the mycelium field, knowing that at any time, mushrooms would pop into existence, and that all fellow prisoners would have to fight to get one. Brick hoped Jesse was a worse fighter than he was, but from the looks of it, Brick is in mondo trouble. Ever try to get out of here? Brick knew that the only way out was through the burrows, a seemingly endless labyrinth filled with monsters and who the heck knows what else. Brick also knew that only one person has ever tried to escape. Brick never speaks her name. But... Brick will never speak of Prisoner X. So Jesse never asked again. <sighs> so, what are you in here for? Brick remembered the day the admin, annoyed with Brick's constant need to narrate, sent him to the Sunshine Institute to break Brick of the habit. Brick was promised release if he stopped, but nothing will ever break Brick's spirit. He will narrate forever. That's it for now. Thanks, Brick. You're welcome. Er, uh, Brick told Jesse, you're welcome.
I hope you're learning how to be a cooperative champion. Wait, what? Is that the admin? You are all here to be reminded of your potential. It's a recording? Come on. And I hope you'll see it in yourself, as I do. Because if you don't, well, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it, eh? In the meantime, demonstrate your cooperative potential, and you just may become the ultimate champion! I don't have anything to craft yet. Nice! I got him! Thanks for picking those for me, noob! Whoa! Nothing personal. I'm just mega, mega hungry! Ah! Give me that! I'm so sorry! I'm so sorry! I'm just so hungry! Uh... <clears throat> Hello? What's going on in here? I should have known it was you causing more trouble, Jesse. Tisk. I say... Tisk. And just who does this contraband belong to, hmm? You all know that weapons are strictly forbidden at the Sunshine Institute. So who does this belong to? You might as well just come out and tell me. It'll be so much easier for everyone. Large Henry won't have to pummel anyone. No one will need to be pummeled. Okay, okay, I, I, I confess, it's mine. I snuck it in. You liar! I crafted that with my own two hands! Stole all the wood, my devil-sugar. <laughs> I mean, oops! Real smart, dude. You know that misbehavior means getting sent down a level. And that means... No! Not the zombie mines! Not the zombie mines! Yes. Perhaps a little time harvesting rotten flesh will teach you something. Take him away. No more fighting. No more rule breaking. Any of you. Jeez, what a jerk. Uh, at least now I can make some stew for radar. Well, it's not much, but hopefully it'll help Radar get his strength back. Voila! One fresh bowl of mushroom stew. Thank you, Jesse. You have no idea how happy... I mean, psh, I guess I'll drink this slop. Interesting attitude there, buddy. I'm gonna have to really step it up. I mean, this is prison. So from now on... I'm prison radar. I'm gonna get my own mushrooms. Make my own stew. Disregard my bedtime. Break whatever rules I feel like. Within reason! Um, whatever. Bro. Yeah. I mean, uh, whatever. Psst. 
Now step aside, Jesse. It's time for Prison Radar to show this world what he's made of. That's right! Come at me, dude! What's going Prisoner on? Prisoner X has escaped! I repeat, Prisoner X has escaped! All guests, please report to the nearest lounge. I think they mean cell? Yep, and you definitely want to stay away from this. This place just keeps getting weirder and weirder, Prisoner X. Yeah, apparently she's this infamous prisoner who they have to keep locked up super tight. Always escaping. They say she even knows her way through that maze. Apparently she's locked up way deep in the prison. So deep that some people have never even seen the level they keep her on. That sounds like the sort of person we should get on our side. Yeah, no kidding. We might be able to get out of here yet with someone like that. But where is she exactly? According to Nurm's sources, Prisoner X is locked up in the deepest, darkest level of the Sunshine Institute. Cell Block X. Uh, detecting a theme with the names. Yeah, they're big on that X thing. We need to get to Cell Block X. Way I heard it, you can't just get into Cell Block X. But, it sounds like the zombie mines are right next door. If we can go down to the mines, maybe we can find this Zara person. Well... You get sent to the zombie mines if you get more in trouble, right? The warden already thinks you're bad news. Doesn't seem like that'll be too hard. Just kick up more trouble. One-way ticket to the zombie mines. But if I get in more trouble, who knows what the warden will do to Radar? He's already been pretty rough on him. Prison Radar ain't scared of the warden anymore. Bring it on! Okay, it's a plan. You stay here and rest up. I'm gonna find a way to get us to cell block X. Roger that, Jesse. But how to get sent down to the lower levels? Hmm. Talk about suspicious looking. There's got to be something in here I can use to get into trouble. do with this. I think there's another room back there, but how do I get in? Secret buttons, nice! Now we're on to something. Okay, time to see what tall, red, and gruesome is hiding. that block. This moves those blocks. Got it. Looks like the buttons move the blocks. someone had been around to see me being this impressive. Hmm. Uh, a moosh room? What the heck are you doing here? Sounding me like I could ask you the same question. Ah! Mind explaining what you're doing in my most private of spaces? Visitors ain't welcome, and you are most definitely a visitor. How about you explain what you're doing? I'm questioning someone, 
who's about to lose a lot of teeth if they don't mind their tune. If you hadn't noticed, you left the hole open. Now get out of my cell before you regret getting in it. Who's this weirdo? Hmm. Huh? Holy cow! A moose room! We can feed the entire room! Hey, hands off! Sharing is caring? What is going on in here? Of course, it's you. Anthony, Shears. This is your last chance to right some wrongs. You shear this moosh room, and I promise no pain will come to them. And if I don't? Then I can't promise to keep that promise. What? No! You don't do it, Jesse! Not liking your hesitation here, Jesse. Go to the nether and jump in a lava lake, Warden. Yeah! Take it away! No! Not my Jeffy! <laughs> you don't know to stop causing trouble, do you? Well, trouble has consequences, Jesse. Dig it up. What the heck are you doing? Teaching you a lesson, Jesse. No more mycelium. They'll starve! You and your friends will be relocated to the lower levels. The zombie mines. Well, isn't this a treat? My rambunctious rival is now my poor prisoner. Get moving. Well, we needed to go to the lower levels anyway. Let's hope they're survivable. Welcome to the zombie mines, Jesse. Oh, just when you think you've seen it all, what exactly is this place? Every few minutes, a million gross zombies spawn. The equally gross prisoners dispatch them and collect the zombie flesh, which is... It gross, I, I get it, but why? Don't know. Don't care. Do your job. Zombies won't fight themselves, so get to fighting. That is sadistic. No two ways around it. Yeah, but it's how the place works. Survival of the fittest and all that. Though survival of the grossest is more accurate here. You brought this on yourself, Jesse. I don't get it. You could have just joined the admin and never had to suffer a second. Instead, you chose to throw it all in the lava pit. I think all of those people cheering for you 24-7 have made you delusional. Made you think that you can just uh, change the world. <laughs> it's sad is what it is. Hey, I'm doing the right thing here. I'm the hero. I'm afraid that hero doesn't mean much in the civilized world if you don't have the power to back it up, Jesse. I'll give you one piece of advice. Just one. Try not to cause any more trouble. If you do, you'll get sent to Maximum. With her. Who's in there? You must have heard those alarms earlier. That was Prisoner X. She tried to escape, but they got her back. And she... she scares me. You don't want to end up in there. So, play nice. Come along, Luna. What was that about? Sounds like that vent is our way to Prisoner X.
Oh, hey! Uh, you want some? Fresh flesh! Wow, you really like that stuff, huh? Nah. Oh? I love it! High in protein, high in flavor, maybe just a little bit poisonous sometimes, but you only live once. You sure you don't want some? Plenty to go around it. What the heck, sure. You won't regret it! Hey, what is this? Oh, the big guy, Oxblood, was down for a while and headbutted the wall? Not sure why, but man, he has a hard head. We just haven't fixed it yet. There's redstone behind the wall. Hmm, I wonder what it connects to. Hey, guys. Hey. Found anything? Not yet. Keeping an eye on those zombie spawners. They could go off any minute, and we don't want to be caught unaware if they do. Keep your eyes open. You know, the name of the place has sun and shine in it. And this place doesn't have either. Zombie and despair might be more accurate words. Gotta be a way in, but this door won't budge. Hey, don't even bother trying to get in. See those item frames? Only the admin and the warden have the right items. And they could be anything. Besides, why would you want into Prisoner X's cell? That's just bonkers. Stay away. You know how certain things are your business? Yeah, this ain't one of them. Well then, someone is salty. Hmm, so that redstone leads to this door. If I can bypass the redstone circuit, I can open the door. Hey guys, over here. Find. We need to find something to bypass a redstone circuit and get this door open. This will lead us to Prisoner X. She can help us get out of here for good. Hey, Jesse! Stop loafing around! You know, we do know someone who came from the outside who might have all her inventory. Ugh, Stella. You know, Jesse, guests and associates really shouldn't be mingling. Yeah, uh, about that. I, uh, need your help. I need to make a lever. Pronto. Why, exactly? Not that I, you know, really care. It's probably stupid. You'd never know when you need a lever. That's what I always say. A lever? In a prison reformatory? Huh. Really, Jesse? Not helping you here. No, not risking angering the admin. I had to really prove myself to get this gig as it is. Not giving it up for you. Forget angering that dork. You don't want to anger me. Yeah, you're gonna have to up your toughness quotient by at least 37% before you get me nervous. I don't know what your game is. 
is here, Jesse, but I won't be intimidated. I have a place here. Respect. Um, you know, and power, and the, yeah, the works. It's actually very prestigious. Many, many people would love to have this position. Yeah, but what about Champion City? You're gonna abandon them? <laughs> Absolutely not. They'll be fine. They will be just... Oh, yeah, who am I kidding? I've done so much for them in the past, I mean, they can barely make bread without me supervising. Okay, look, maybe this isn't my dream destination. This place is horrible, and I am worried I will never get the smell out of my hair. Here's the cobblestone and stick. But you need to get me out of here. I know we've had our issues, but I also know that you're a hero or whatever. That's not too much, right? Uh, sure, Stella, we'd be happy to have you. If you're happy, I'm happy. No matter how many worlds I see, it always seems to come back to levers. Let's do this. Zombie wave incoming! Prepare yourself! surprised admin it's not enough that you disregarded all the rules in my icy palace of doom tried to upset the delicate order of the sunshine institute now you're trying to disrupt the therapeutic benefits of my zombie mine what gives pretty sure your fellow inmates were just trying to peacefully live out the rest of their captivities well after you came to beacon town and wrecked everything it seemed like the least i could do it's terribly rude, is what it is! <laughs> Admin! Sir! I'm very disappointed in you, Warden. I I'm j I'm j uh, yeah, I'm just a nervous eater. I'm sorry. Ugh, no, not that. I'm disappointed that you couldn't keep Jesse in line for one measly day! I was just trying to do my job, and now I'm in trouble because of you! This job isn't easy to begin with. Why do you have to go and make it harder? Yeah, sorry about that, Warden, but you kind of work for a terrible person. He doesn't deserve an apology, Jesse! Oh, for the love of... Enough! How thrilling you disappoint me! goes 
between you and you and you and especially you. And as for you, I've been looking for an opportunity for you to prove your loyalty, to prove your worth as my champion. I suggest you pull out your sword and attack Jesse. And as for you, Jesse, well, I don't think I don't believe in fair play. <laughs> now we'll have some real fun. I had such high hopes for you, Jesse. The highest of hopes! Help! Jack! Mouth shut, ears open. We only have one chance here. I'm gonna head over to the admin and we'll both attack him. Trust me, friend. You're joking, right? That's your big idea. Swords can't hurt me. Uh oh. Oh! All I asked you to do is fight your friend to the death, and you can't even do that. I don't even want you to be my friend anymore, and I don't want you to be my friend either. In fact, as far as I'm concerned, this whole place can burn to the ground. What about? Prisoner X? What about all of us? The Institute remains inescapable. So what do I care? I'm leaving. And I'm never thinking about any of you ever again. Guess I'll just be my own friend now. Can't dwell on the setbacks. Gotta keep looking forward. What are you doing? This isn't how you make friends. Oh, I think I know what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm gonna have loads of friends soon. After all. Everyone loves Jesse, right? No. <gasps> no way. You coming? I'm sorry. Uh, shut up with the sorries, you doof. Let's hope Prisoner X is really our ticket out of here. Man, am I glad you're okay, Jack. Hmm. Yeah, uh, it got a little dicey there for a while, didn't it? I mean, after what happened with you know, not Voss, then I was in the admin's freaky place and, and uh, not in control of what I was I was uh, doing. I was in pain. I, I I I was so scared that you'd all give up on me. Hey, that's that sounds horrible. Jack, we would never give up on you. 
Yeah. Hey. I appreciate that, but if you'd seen what I'd seen, Beacon Town was already worried about you, Jesse. Wondering where you were, wondering if you were okay. I'm sure the admin is heading there right now. Wearing Jesse's mug to boot. It's freaking messed up, yo. It's true. Identity theft is no joke. Admin made a mistake messing with me, and I'm not letting him get away with it. We made it. Wow. some intense security. Just stick close to Jesse, all right? Mm. We'll be fine. Don't worry. Yeah, you guys go on. Get Prisoner X. Huh. If I wanted to imprison the dreaded Prisoner X, that's where I'd do it. I think that's where we need to go. All we have to do is cross this conduit, reach the platform, jump down, and not die. Mm. Come on, I think we can make that jump. Oh. You're up next, Nurm. Oh. Okay, now you, Loon. <laughs> Seriously, how do you do that? <laughs> Last jump! I'm Jesse. You must be Prisoner X. <sighs> Bold of you to come here, not knowing who you're dealing with. I could shove you right into that lava, and you deserve it for being so trusting, so gullible. Just one little push. <laughs> and sizzle, sizzle, sizzle! I'm not your enemy. You don't need to threaten me. Yes, but it's so much fun fun to threaten you. I don't get much fun these days. Look, Prisoner X... Zara! You're supposed to know how to get out of here, right? What? Where did you get that idea? <sighs> no one's ever escaped the Sunshine Institute. And no one ever will. You try to escape all the time. Why would you do that if you didn't know the way out? I get bored from time to time. I like to stretch my legs, beat up a few guards. It doesn't mean a thing. The admin stole my identity and he's running around with my face doing horrible things in my name. I gotta get out of here now. Romeo was here? Just now? Well, um, the admin was, but who's... Romeo. That's his real name. You didn't think admin was his given name, did you? He would want you to think that. Of course he would. That? was not the name I was expecting. Like Jesse is any better? I'm not judging, just surprised. But Jesse is better, it's much better. You must really be something if you made him so mad. He almost never comes down here in person, except to put the warden's feet to the fire from time to time. Well, there is no more warden. The admin fired him. That's fantastic. We won't have any trouble escaping with that little creep out of the picture. So now you want to help Any me? Any enemy of Romeo is a friend of mine, I always say. Well, I've never technically said that. 
but I think it sounds pretty good. How can I trust you know the way out? Oh, don't worry, I know the way. I'm the only one who does. If you know the way, then show me. Let's get out of here. Just one problem. This whole room is rigged to explode if I step one foot out of it. Explode? Take a look around. If someone doesn't stand on at least one of these pressure plates on the floor, these sticky pistons will retract. Lava meets TNT. And then the whole place blows up before you can say kaboom. <laughs> That's a stone pressure plate. That means I can't just use a block. Oh, it's fine. One of your silly companions can stay behind. The rest of us can go. That's the situation. That's the only way out. Look, I know this has come as a bit of a surprise, but I think it's for the best we move past this awkward silence and press on with our escape. Oh, I hate to be a wet slime about all of this, but we have to get moving. I can't just leave them here. Then just leave one of them here. As long as one pressure plate is stood upon, the trap won't spring. So either the villager or the llama must remain behind. Nerm, no, you can't do that. Oh, come on, we seriously don't have time for this. I'm leaving. If you're interested in escaping the Sunshine Institute alive, I suggest you do the same. This nerm? Hmm. Stella did ask me to look after her. Come on, Luna. We gotta go. Hmm. 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 I promise we'll be back for you. Hmm. Hmm. How did you... My straitjacket? Oh, that was the easy part. If you're done with your tearful goodbyes, we have a prison to escape from. Prisoner X, I presume? Yeah, guys, this is Zara. Zara, the guys. Hello. Where, uh, where's Nerm? Oh, your villager friend offered to take my place so my cell's booby traps wouldn't go off. <gasps> what? No. He... he did that? And you let him? Zara knows how to defeat the admin. We'll come back for him when this is all over. Yeah, if there's still a nerm to come back for. <sighs> well, no matter what it takes, no matter how many heads I have to clobber, I will get him back. She better be worth it. Trust me, I'm worth it. Ugh, can we get going, or is the reunion still underway? Yeah, we're going, we're going. Come on. have escaped their lounges! The warden's been fired! <laughs> Zombie meat is back on the menu! When I find that warden, I'm gonna make him pay for what he put me through! Yipes. Wouldn't want to be the warden right now. 
Every prisoner in this place wants to tear him to pieces. He better watch his back. And his front, and his side. Yeah, lots of watching in his future. It's what he deserves. I won't be losing any sleep over it. <sighs> I wonder what the Warden will lose when the prisoners find him. Let's see if they left us any weapons. Weapons! Sweet, sweet weapons! I could take the enchanted iron sword, or the diamond sword with no enchantment. The diamond sword will last longer, but the iron sword is enchanted with sharpness. Not bad, hmm. Okay, definitely feeling better with a sword in my hand again. Agreed. What? It's versatile. I don't know much about llama fashion, but that's a good look, Luna. Looking good, gang. Now let's... G-E-O-F-F. That spells my best friend. <laughs> Love you, Jeffy. Friends reunited! It's a prison miracle! I guess Jesse does seem like good people. Oh, jeez. They're holding us up. Move along. Now. Rex, oh jeez, I don't want no trouble. I'm out of here! Come along, Jeffy! That was frighteningly effective. Well, now that that's over with, can we get moving now, please? The opening should be just around this corner. We have a situation here. Back! Back! All of you! One more step, and it's Kaboomsville! Jesse! Warden, what's going on here? Hey! You're one of us! Help us beat up the Warden! It'll be a good team-building exercise! Plus, we beat up the Warden! Win-win! Oh, it's the happy little jerk who didn't like my happy little painting. I'll bet you're not so happy now, are you? Jesse, you free... Prisoner X? Just when I thought you couldn't ruin my life anymore! What in the world were you thinking? Holy crud! It's Prisoner X! I think you've clearly lost your mind. She is bad news. Actually, no, she is way worse than bad news. I need her help, Warden. It's the only way to stop the admin. Did you know she was once an admin, too? The admin had to take her powers away! She tried to destroy him! I promised the admin I'd never let her free, no matter what! And I'll keep that promise. Even if I need to blow us all up to do it! Later, <laughs> Tate. <laughs> staring at me. It's making me uncomfortable. Hand over that bow. It's too dangerous to let you keep it. Not happening, Jesse. I need this weapon to get through that maze of monsters. We want answers, Zara. Uh, fine. Yes, I was an admin. Ages ago, Romeo took my admin powers away from me just before he banished me to this pitiful prison. But I'm not the villain here. Romeo and his little warden were the ones who put you down here, not me! So glare in another direction! I'm innocent! You're just another victim of the admin. Just like the rest of us. And there will be a lot more victims if he isn't stopped. Soon. Don't 
Don't believe a word she says, Jesse. She'll say whatever she can to get in your good graces. Wait, so an admin can be stripped of their powers? Ugh, it's not simple, but yes. So what do we... We don't have time for this. It won't be long before Romeo finds out what's happened down here. Yeah, I guess we should keep moving. Follow me. I don't know if I can go with her, Jesse. I don't trust her. Petra, you haven't seen what the admin is capable of. We need any help we can find. But really? Her? I don't exactly have another ex-admin in my inventory, Petra. Uh, but we have to be able to... There must be a... Jack's right. We need Zara's help. It's the only way. I just hope you're right. Don't forget that she used to be an admin, too. Romeo did always love creating new nightmares at every opportunity. Uh, run! Yep. Hey, hey. Seriously, what's with these monsters? They're all glowing! They're pretty scary looking, Jesse. Let's be scarier. Just let me think! Sure it's just thinking? Ah! Zara, just tell the truth. Are you lost? No. Not exactly. Wait. We can just build to the top of the wall and get to the other side that way. Yeah! Sounds good to me.
Wow. <sighs> what do you know? There it is. Hey, wait, where are you going? She ditched us! was unbelievable and you stuck the landing nice oh that it's just my perfect reflexes and photographic muscle memory well there it is guys our ticket out of here that is sparkly the sparkliest is that diamond <laughs> where is everyone that maniac is gonna get herself killed would that be such a bad thing we should lend her a hand shouldn't we Maybe we should just go. But she sounds like she's in serious trouble. She's the one who ran off on her. She can find her own way to the tower. We're leaving. There's no time. We gotta go. Man, cold-blooded. It'll be better this way, Jesse. Yeah, much safer. Going somewhere? God! Ah! Where did you just come from? Tarnation! It's the llama thing all over again! I just came from filling a ghast full of arrows. No thanks to you people! Okay, great. We're all together again. Let's keep moving! <sighs> Whoa! 
You were gonna leave me behind. Not very kind of you. I need you to trust me, Jesse. If we're gonna work together... Sure, I'll try. And I'll try to rein in my more eccentric impulses, if I must. There's something else you should know. There was a third admin named Fred. Where is he? Dead. He and I fought Romeo for control of the world. We lost. the rest of it yeah how are we supposed to escape this doesn't even go up that far that's because we're not going up we're going down down there is no down we're standing on bedrock you can't go any lower you might think so but that's where we need to go below the bedrock everybody knows there's nothing under the bedrock except nothing and also certain death they're right Zara there's nothing below bedrock everyone knows that everyone thinks that I'd rather take my chances in the maze than listen to any more of her lies. Any of you are welcome to join me. It's crazy talk, all those monsters. I don't care. She's an admin. An admin killed Voss, then stole his identity, and then... Remember I told you he took my admin powers away? Well, down there lies the secret to taking Romeo's powers from him forever. Fred, the third admin, discovered it. Jesse, help me dig through this tower. See? I told you! These stairs lead to our salvation! Now there's a good reason to get a move on. disguise as me or my friends. The amount of chaos they could cause is, well, it's unthinkable. That's why I summoned you. Track them down. Make sure they're behaving themselves. Man, oh jeez. Run, 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 Jesse. As fast as you can. 